I don't know how you guys handle this kind of stuff, but the older I get, the more I get attached to things. And today's video is about my old cherry tree. I know this tree since I was a little kid and I have so many beautiful memories about the tree. It's in my garden, uh, that was my grandma's garden before. And I look at this huge, beautiful giant every day. So many beautiful memories. It always has such beautiful cherry blossoms. And some years back I did a video about that, where I captured uh, the cherry blossoms on the tree with my big camera on a big plate. So I will link that video down below. Uh, I'm glad I did that back then. In the recent years, a lot of heavy rain and thunderstorms hit the tree hard. Every year some big branches came down uh, and now I learned that the tree is hollow and too dangerous to keep it in my garden. So it has to go. Yeah, and before it goes I want to do a last memory. I will capture it with a big glass plate and I will use a very old developer and a very old collodion. So I get this old faded look because it's the end of the tree and I think this kind of look makes sense on a red plate. I did something similar with my apple tree but it was the other way around. We thought already it is dying but out of nothing the tree grew out of the hollow uh, branches by itself. Like the tree is hollow and the branches came out of the hollow tree. And when I saw that and the first apples came back uh, on the tree, I thought I have to capture that. And I captured it also with a glass plate, but with a fresh collodion and fresh developer, so it gets a totally different look. I will show you both of the plates at the end of the video. And now enjoy my last memory of this beautiful tree.
And here are both blades side by side. One of the blades stays for a new start and the other one stays for the end. So it's really time to say goodbye for the tree. So maybe I will use the wood for, for some camera parts. Let's see if there is enough uh, that I can use. That would be also a good memory, I think. Yeah, and otherwise, I want to say thanks again to all my Patreon supporters. You guys are awesome. Also, thanks for all the guys who watch my videos here. All of you guys, thanks a lot for uh, taking the time and, and writing comments. And I really appreciate it a lot. And as always, I'll be back, guys.